Yes, this is my favorite map. My favorite map to play TFT on. It is the Treasure Trove, ladies and gentlemen. Let's grab that large rod. Let's grab our treasures. Let's see what we got. We got a Zinzao Double Poppy. Okay, let's grab the Zoe's. Okay, another Zoe. Lucian Leona. Two star twist of fate. We don't want Zinzaos. Definitely don't care about Zinzao. Let's go to level four. Alright, so we could go two Vanguards or two Chrono. I think it's two Chrono. Let's go two Chrono and Zinzao. Let's go out and expark on Zinzao. You know what? If we get an early two star Zinzao, I'll take it. Alright, I'll take it. Definitely don't like this guy. Actually, uh, I think Malphite was better here. Yeah, that was a mistake. I forgot about. I didn't realize I had a second brawler here. So, uh, definitely a misplay. Definitely a misplay. Here we go, two star Poppy. Rumble, yep. So, if you're playing Sorcerers, mech is always good. So we're gonna swap it up with two Vanguards now. Give this to Poppy. Yeah, I think this is gonna be a Sorcerer game. I like playing Sorcerers. I do like playing them. They're very fun. Uh, but they're... They're tricky. Sometimes they're kind of tricky to play. Sometimes not as consistent. But regardless, I think it's a very fun comp to play. I like to see a lot of that magic damage going through. I don't want to play Mystic Vanguard. Although they can definitely work, especially on this map. Because Treasure Trove gives you all those good items. So you can kind of play any comp that requires items. Mystic Vanguard is one of those comps. It does require some of those items to be good. Okay, so I think it's going to be... I think it's going to be that Tear Syndra. Yeah, let's grab that. Let's go to level 5 now, and then we can go 3-star Guardian with Syndra. This should be an easy fight. He's got some weak Cybers. I definitely have the better team. Could we make money here? I could if I drop the Rumble. I don't think I want to drop the Rumble. Man, we're getting so many Chronos. We just got two Shens last turn. I definitely like the chrono comps as well, but in most cases, pushing the to those six and eight chrono numbers are a bait, and they don't work very well uh, in ranked. Like you know, I want to win this ranking, right? We don't want to lose, so we're not gonna play anything that's too risky here. We got a Wukong, so Wukong is gonna be better than Leona. Yeah, we certainly got so many chronos, because who really goes for six and eight chronos? Nobody. So let's look at what everyone's got. Someone's already got a Jinx. Two star Jace. Looks pretty strong. I don't see any Vanguard Mystics. So that's kind of good for me. I would say four Mystics are kind of going to be the harder to deal with comps. And yes, you guys just saw me drop the valuable Jinx that we got as an item drop. Because I don't really want to play Jinx anyways. So we have Double Glove. I don't know about Thieves Glove. I feel like, see, the thing is, if we go for Mech, we should be combining the glove with, like, Quicksilver Sash, items like that, to help our Mech, you know, not get crowd controlled. So I'm gonna keep the glove. I'm gonna make money here. Let's go 40. Let's go to level six now, and we actually do have the three Mechs. We've collected them in the last turn. Uh, so we could go for the three mechs right now. It's just, do I want to drop all of these guys? Yeah, I guess so. I'm going to drop all of them. So we're going to try this. Three mech and two vanguard, two chrono, two sorcerer. I just want a bonus of everything right now. Just a little bit of each. And if this doesn't work, then I guess we'll bring back this, the four sorcs. We can do four sorcs as well. So we're just going to keep our mech vanguards for now. No need to really change this team. And... We only have three sor- oh wait, we do have four sorcerers. Yeah. Because of Annie. 
so Annie's of course a sorcerer, so we actually could have went for four swords as well, but this comp's working fine, so so we will want to get the Negatron, I think. Yeah. Oh, that's taken. Do I want the tier? Giant Spelt is okay as well. I think we'll go for the Giant Spelt. Giant Spelt Glove. I like to go for Trap Claw on our mech. Let's go to level 7. I'm going to go fast 7 because we're going to be almost at 50 gold still. I'll just put a Zoe on the board. I guess I could have dropped the Poppy for four Sorcerers. Yeah, I think I think maybe we should just do that next turn. We don't really need Poppy anymore. But Trap Claw is a very good item on, on a mech. Gives you some dodge. Don't forget about the dodge that comes with this item. I'm just going to drop the Poppy. Drop the Poppy. Four Sorcerer with Syndra. Let's put Dionic Spark on the Rumble. And yeah, we're doing solid. I'm kind of hoping to get a three-star twist of fate. You know, just, of course, having three-star champions is always going to be beneficial. It's never going to be bad. But if we don't get three-star twist of fate, that is fine as well. There is one other player playing Sorcerer in this game, but he's going for the Ribbon Sorcerer, and that's different. That's a different build. Let's see what everyone has. So this guy has Snipers. Cybers, so this is right here. This is the Riven Sorcerer build, so this is different than mine. He might go for mech, but I don't think so. If he commits to Riven, he's not going to. And then that's uh, Jace build with, yeah, Jinx probably. And then Brawler, Jinx, probably Cybers. Okay, great. So it's always the same kind of comps. So we got a whole bunch of good items now as well. And the Spatula can give us a Star Guardian charm. However, I don't know about going for Star Guardians. We're gonna just go to level 8 here. I'm gonna go fast 8. Just gonna put 3 Star Guardians on the board. And... Yeah, I'm, I'm going fast 8 because we're doing so well. Normally I don't go level 8 at this point. I just keep saving money. But we have so much money. I like the blue buff. Uh, and then it's probably... I might go Shroud. Shroud is pretty good. Also gives you more dodge with the Trap Claw on your mech. Titan's Resolve is kind of standard for your mech as well, but because you get to also increase the mana cost, which is pretty pretty strong. That's a strong ability to have. So we got 2-star Syndra, Echo, and Gangplank. Do I want blue buff on Syndra? I don't mind her having it for now. I don't mind that. So we have Echo and Gangplank. So we can put these in for the bonuses. We could turn someone into an infiltrator here as well. So we have like every bonus. Like this is uh, not a six sorcerer build at the moment. It's just like everything that we need. A little bit of each all on the board. I don't know if I have space for Riven. I'm going to sell her. I don't think I care about Riven. So guess what? This man already hit 3 star bean. Nice. Yeah, we're not going to have a good time against this. Yeah, this is going to be instant loss right now. I think it's their twist of fate. Like, I would love to still use this guy. Should I still use him? I really don't see anyone build it. I think we need another large rod. Yeah, let's go for that. All right, let's roll again. We got Rumble. Trying to two-star, yep, yeah, our mech. That's great. And then we have Victor again. Double Jinx. Faster impact. That's good. All right, let's go for a Guardian Angel on Gangplank. That's a mandatory item on him. And then probably Morello. Yep. Yeah. Probably Morello Thresh. Do I have a spot to put him in? We might. He can work with Twisted Fate. So if we drop the Echo, then Thresh is not a bad choice. See, this is Sorcerer Riven. This is Power of Sorcerer Riven. He almost beat us. I'm really confused right now. I don't know if I should go... Yeah, I feel like Thresh... Instead instead of Echo would be better. Echo is really nice to have. He's pretty strong, but... Gangplank for sure we're keeping. 
Okay, the demolitionist bonus is a must. Uh, but we don't really need Echo. Thresh can pull guys to the board. I like that. Let's sell the Syndra. I'm going to swap her for Victor. And then Thresh instead of Echo. We have Triple Ribbon. This is the only guy who's playing Ribbon, I guess. But I don't know why we're getting so many Ribbon. Um, yeah, that's a six Sorcerer Ribbon build. Six Rebels, six Cybers. A lot of Cybers and Rebels, of course. Like in every ranked game you guys are going to be in, in this current patch. Lots of good stuff. Oh, we can't grab that. Okay, so we got a Thresh. Two star. There is no Zephyr. Like, people are just not building stuff, I guess. And then... I'm gonna go one Morello on the Vic. Spatula... Star Guardian Charm would have been okay if I had kept, if I kept uh, my Syndra. I can always bring one back, but then I lose the Chrono Bonus. You know what? I think it's actually the Infiltrator item. It's too bad we're not getting that Twisted Fate. Um, or I think it's Infiltrator Gangplank. Yeah, uh, so we don't need to put Echo in this case. So I just made Gangplank into an Infiltrator. Should I give him Ionic Spark? Gangplank Sorcerer bonus is super strong, so... And he, his cannon hits the back line, that's pretty good. That's actually a pretty solid idea, I like that. Alright, I'm gonna go for... I'm gonna go for Chalice. Where are you, Zoe? I'm gonna go for Chalice, and then I think it's, I think it's Morello actually. I think it's Morello and then Quicksilver Sash. I finally decided on what I want to do, guys. But Infiltrator Gangplank, it's kind of cool. We just need to two-star him. Well, let's get the Zephyr. We don't want anyone to have that. So yeah, we're gonna go for the. We're gonna go for Morello. I'll give it to Gangplank. And then Quicksilver Sash. Yeah, let's go Quicksilver on the Rumble, and then we'll have a Zephyr to use. I finally decided all my items. Alright, just give that to her. So it looks like we might not get a 3 star Twist of Fate. I should probably just give up on it. I should probably just give up on a 3 star Twist of Fate. Here we go, we got two strikes. And six Sorcerer event. He has almost a three star event. We got the Zephyr on the Vic, so this is really good. We should be able to beat him now. It sucks that we still have a one star victor right now. Oh, come on, really? Yes, we got him. Uh oh, Riven's gonna come back to life. Massive damage. Yeah, Riven's doing a ton of damage right now. Yeah, okay. Man, this is so sad. I could have got him to three stars. So close. We definitely want Aurelian. Alright. Oh, wow. As, I, as soon as I sell my Rumbles, the Rumbles come back. Let's go to level 9. Because I want to put Aurelian on the board. I'll put two Chalice on the Zoe. And then we have Infinity Edge. Oh wait, Rapid Fire Can of Urgot's pretty good too. I'm planning to put a second Rumble on the board. That's why I'm holding my Rumbles. I think we're gonna put... Ooh, yeah, I think... Here we go, two star to rumble. Finally, we got a second Vic. Okay, so what I'm gonna have to do is, dang, I might have to sell this. Yeah, that's fine, I'll sell him. Because what I'm gonna do is, so when you have, this is a mech trick. You can drop the fizz and just have two rumbles to any transform. 
and then the fizz will just jump to the back. So the fizz should jump to the back. Yep. So if you put those three in the line, fizz jumps to the back. Oh, he died before he fired his mega shark. So sad, but we can beat him still. So yeah, this is a cool mech trick. We're still gonna lose though. Oh, maybe not. Alright, here we go. This is the cyber guy. So the three star cyber vein player died by the way. This is another cyber player. Uh, so... Yeah, three star cyber vein does not always mean a first. It does not always mean it's a f gonna be a first. So I grabbed an Urgot from the carousel. We got Zerath. We got two star Urgot. So this is good for my Thresh to pull. Boom. Ah, oh, damn. He had his Echo here and then he moved there last second. I feel like I should have grabbed the Shroud. I might have made a mistake by not grabbing the Shroud. But I wanted to two star my Urgot real bad. Oh boy. Oh, I guess we lose. I guess we lose. So that's it guys. We lost. But uh, we tried. We tried to beat the Cybers. Unfortunately we could not. Uh, but you know what? This build definitely still works in ranked. Give it a shot. If you guys want to try the cool mech trick, go ahead.